Psalm 118, the Bible says, This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad. Amen. Amen. Psalm 118, the Bible says, This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad. Amen. Amen. Psalm 118, the Bible says, This is the day that Tak tak tadi lo tolong tolong ayat tua, ia fikir yang aku tak faham ia fikir aku tak faham. We welcome the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit into our celebration today. Welcome, 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 families and friends, fathers and mothers, children who are here today to be part of this celebration of Tui and Grace's wedding day. We welcome you in the name of Jesus. That that if you fear to attack or to obey, what fault are from when you see so bright? The mind, fae, maheni, or sola, or lava mai e hoa ko. Ni mau that that if you fear to go to e hoa fa, or to obey to see so bright. Let us look to God in prayer, because it is a signal that we need His guidance. We need His help. In this wonderful celebration day that we are in, ko kore kita pama ke eki lo tu eki ku mau tu lolo yo ao yo hoa koi. Mau fai lo mai atu yo tua, ai mata anga e tangata. Ko mata anga e tangata, ko mata anga ia ai yo tua. Mau vete yo ao yo tua ko eki ai ha tau kei ia, ko eki ha poto ia ai yo tua, ko eki ha ilo ia ai yo tua. Ko ta taki a ki yo tua ai aho mau inga yo tua ko frama. Ya fayloma, ai no formali e ahoe. O ya iki mau to ma pe pe he be va e si su. Fa fe i kuri ke ma tataki e yo wau. Polo kalama, o ya ho ko ni o tu. O ya ho ku ma hu ing. O ya ho na te u ko mi mu. O ya ho ni o tu. O ko yo ya na fa ka ka ka. Tu ke hi fo ho lau ma li e o tataki e o tu. Ka tu ke mu ai ki ke ma mu i mu i pe. Ma u tali ang i pe. Yang awal lau mali yang mau nyonyi, kau ahoni, kau fail orang iya, aki ay covid ni te, kau lele mai ay tamai, lele mai ay fae, lele mai ay tua iki ay maheni pamoe, am family kalau kau tua, kau mau tu kau tu be, kau lo tolo tonga, kau fina kalau ay tua, that is our prayer, our God that we need you, we do not have strength and wisdom. To mark, Lord, the significant event that we are celebrating today without your help, your guidance. And Lord, we ask, Lord, let your peace, let your love rest upon us as we celebrate marriage because it is godly and it's ordained by you, O God. And let your name, Lord, be glorified in this celebration. In Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen. I now let the worship team take us into worship.
Pray God's blessing upon me now and in the years ahead. Marriage is a gift of God, our Creator, whose intention is that husband and wife should be united in heart, body, and mind. In their union, they fulfill their love for each other. Marriage involves caring and giving. It involves learning to share one's life with another person forgiving as Christ forgives, enjoying the love and meaning which can be found together. It involves facing together whatever adversity may arise. Marriage is a way of life to be upheld and honored. No one should enter into it lightly. It involves a serious and lifelong commitment to, it, to each other's good in a union of strength, sympathy and delight. From this beginning, God draws them now to a completely new life. They become awake to each other, aware of each other, sensitive to each other's needs. And so here in the presence of God, we recognize and affirm the relationship as they begin their married life in the community. Buyasi and Grace, we welcome you. We are glad to join with you in the celebration of your marriage, to witness your vows, to pray with you and to bless you, and to wish you joy in your life together. And so for our part, we ask you to make your public declaration. So we ask you of your own free choice, will you take grace to be your wife? I do. Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her, in sickness and in health, in forsaking all others, be faithful to her as long as you both shall live. <coughs> Grace of your own free choice, will you take Boyasi to be your husband? I do. Will you love him, comfort him, honour and keep him in sickness and in health, in forsaking all others? Be faithful to him as long as you both shall live. I will. Thank you. If you could be outstanding, our two friends and family, 
uh, and the church to be upstanding. In this time, we will affirm uh, the last of embraces marriage before the vows. I will ask you all a question. You have two words. We will. So friends and family, you have come to witness this exchange of vows. Will you do all in your power to support this marriage now and in the years ahead? We will. We will. Thank you all who may be seated. Family, at this time, uh, we come to the vows which the couple have written and we will now hear from them. Grace, my faith. What can I say, huh? journey has been but an honor to be doing the life of you. Um, through the ups and downs, through the stormy days, I thank God for continuously showing his love and grace over the both of us as individuals and as a couple. And I thank you yourself for being the awesome, caring, Love and support of girlfriend, fiance, best friend, soon to be wife. I thank you for everything you've done for me, for the smallest thing to the biggest thing. But it's been a privilege, honor to also be serving on the house of the Lord with you. We've, we've come such a long way from the beginning. As nervous as I am looking at you, uh, I love you. Um, I can't wait to continue this journey with you. Uh, as we stand here in front of our friends and our family, always in the presence of the Lord, I thank Him for the past four years of our relationship being together. For He has never failed us nor forsaken us. To continue to show the love of our relationship. And therefore, grace by faith, I continue to love, care, support you, and continue to be your mother. Thank you. You look so handsome today. <laughs> Honey, before anything, I take this time to acknowledge that before you are mine, you are God's. You are Christ's. You are His son. Your parents, your religious. And today I stand before our family and friends and acknowledge and acknowledge and acknowledge you as my best friend, my faithful lover. And handsome husband, and now my handsome husband. I told you one friend request and a dear on your 20th birthday to talk to me, and then a month of talking, and then one day four years ago to call me, and now we're getting married on a Christ. One of the most beautiful things anyone can do. The love we talk to each other is what captured my heart. You, you were comfortable enough to be vulnerable with me. You didn't... Well, I didn't finish this, but... I remember the moment that we spoke, uh, talked to, talk, um, talk to each other, call each other. What captured my heart is how vulnerable you were with me. And I, I knew that the only love and care that I could give to you is from and through Christ. And that the fact that you didn't accept anything about that, I knew to be married to you. <laughs> so here I am. We got to see. Thought of that. Many men thought. Not me, not me. God will see. I vow to be your wife. Your best friend. Your other half. Your better half. On days that you are. Um, Feeling the best to 
for your burgers, cheerleader, always. Not just in tights, but in the I vow, I vow to help you serve in any position that you are given, not just in the church, but in this world by Christ. And I vow to learn how to cook because you love to. You're the cook between us and it's not fair that you just feed me. I vow to be your wife and your one and only always. You're my best friend, and my sister asked me today, Gracie, why do you love food? I said, there's no one in this world that I can imagine myself with. But you, I love you, and let's get married. <laughs> mm-hmm. So do you embrace. <coughs> These rings is a token of faithfulness. Commitment and never ending love. Which means that everything that you have doing, you now have to share with grace. It's no longer yours alone. But you need to share. What was two has now become one. Let us just pray. Oh God, we stand before you. This day our God, Lord, to take on a ring as a symbol of faithfulness, integrity, love, perseverance. We submit it before you, oh God, that they will take it with such a weight that their life has been signed, oh God, to a covenant. It is no longer known as two people, but one, one in you. Let your will be done in Dewey's life and also Grace's life. And let your name be glorified. Amen.
I will read <coughs> one to five. I am the true vine, and my father is the God. He cuts off every branch in me that bears no fruit. But every branch that does bear fruit, he prunes so that it will be even more fruitful. You are already clean because of the word I have spoken to you. Remain in me, now will remain in you. No branch can be a fruit by itself. It must remain in the vine. Neither can you be a fruit unless you remain in me. I am the true vine. You are the branches. If a man remains in me and I in him, he will be a much fruit. Apart from me, you can do nothing. Eki kofolo fola ya, pako ya mau pelu, kia ya mau mahtui, pelu kia ya mau mauwi, tulolo kia ya tua eki fata anga koi ni, tulolo kia ya tua humau loto. Kaya ole baku kelea ya humau loto loto nga, ke omiha tuhul. Ke halafononga in the formal. Tuk eki ke lave ya lot of to be with him. Om ya fara to lahi. Te u ya ke mo ya tu ya si pa pe ki a grace. Ko hinga ko in the formal. Ba tu ke lang lang ya pe ko hua fa. Pa pe ta ki eki. Ko fa pe ke ta ke fa fa ki ta to lu ki kama ta ama ko ya na ya na eki. O omia ai wa o ta. Ta ta pupe pa mo ki mo tolu e no wa koini. Ko yo wa u koini ne ke ke faka ho koia ha fare lotu. Ne ke ke faka ho koia ha tempare. Ka ne faka ho koia he ngowe. Ngowe ka ite. Pa ka faka ha muia pa ka vivire ha ta u loto. U ke ke ta u ka u kei he ngowe koini. Ta u foki pe ke he foro fora. He ko e ngowe o buha o buya ke ta u ki he ngowe. I would just like to take us back to the origin of marriage. And excuse me if I'm stepping on any toes, it was not performed in a church or a temple, but it was done in the garden. Amen. And we have no experience in marriage life. So my hope is that we are united together. Let's go back to the garden, because the garden, there was a gardener Amen. who looked after what was in the garden. When we're in a garden, there is a, 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 a gardener who looks after the, everything that is in the garden. And we will just connect that with marriage today. Remain in me. Amen. To embrace, a decision has to be made that you have to remain in God. Amen. But you must keep in mind that when you are in the garden, the gardener is the boss. Amen. We must surrender and, and we must surrender everything that is within us. Amen. Because it's not our way, it's his way. Aku faham 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 buat buat tak apa lagi. Aye, aye ni aku faham hebat tengah tak tahu hingga awal. Tapi aye follow follow. Aku awak hebat tengah tak tahu hingga awal atau terus. The very first thing that the gardener does is to cut off what is not fruitful in our life. The commitment that you guys have made today, there are things that we have to cut off from the previous life. That is no longer going to be fruitful in marriage. Koi mo iyo tau si tuo ba mia i o pa ko tuo si nga mia i tau hu ke kovin na nite o nofo mai. Koi han na i ham ya ngawe ke fai ke ngawe koi ni ka koi folo folo i otu. That is the problem when we walk into a covenant and we are willing to carry on what is not fruitful into that covenant. Koi otu wa koi ya ko ni nga ilo i. To your grace, there are things that you probably enjoy that God would need to cut off. In this covenant, you cannot bring everything from outside. 
But once you enter his covenant, it is his way, not our way. Kaya mga tuwo siya lahi me ay hatan mo tau huwa kaya kovna ni te mari. From your own perspective, grace and 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 tui and grace. You will know. I will not go into that. But let me go in deeper. That not only you guys have to cut off things. We as families. Kung tao tulong si my family, kung tao fita haya kaya mo yata tui kamo crazy. Para makaya tao mo yata na kahit may gwa. Kung yung alma yung nofamari at tui kamo crazy. Kaya mo kaya kaya tui siya kaya apoy ni. Kaya tui tui niya yata mo. But allow me to speak more. Because generational curse according to marriage will grow until we put a stop to it. Take it out of the door, yeah, or for a matter. The one more needs in my family, quite for a malaria, and for Mari. Take a lava hiding, what a matter of a pot or taofi coil. That's a bit of a lie. But my way, I did not do. If you don't know, I ought to buy a community for all going me. Kaya nga yung pagkamalaiya ay hindi na formali o butafe ba may kahit family for bakit pagkangat ay ako ni? Yung malawi o yung follow follow ayoko. We need to cut off any thoughts of giving up. Because can I tell you there are mountains, there are valleys in this path, and many have given up. I do not want there to be a trend in this covenant. Kau yang memang faham kita orang apa yang kita tuan kita faham kita hebat apa? Yang kami memang kita ah, kami memang kita faham kami tahu tangan kita kami nak faham lagi kita nak faham lagi. Ah, ni faham kita apa? Kau yang tuan kita faham kita apa? Kaya kami yang boleh lay. Ibu mahu ini. Tiada orang awak ni kita tu boleh kiri. Kita tahu mahu ini. Tu yang grace. There have been many prayers over your life. <coughs> if we are to connect the past and the current, we will see there were bended knees over your life. They were not known. They did not make the front page of our daily newspapers. But they were knowing to God every morning that they bow their knees and they pour out their prayer over your lives. Mo we love to. Papa o tua ge au han ni ge to tu pole kina. Ge au ma ki no to le ko hili de no ma ha am ma ya no tu. Le ki mo ge ka bo ya ge fono ma o ta wa si ai a ko. Au han ni o tua. Ai ga hi to oi pe he ge tu pole kina. Could you will be a fool. Yai singai, fae kamai pemain singai kui. Kaki mawa nama tay toh ya tau tol. Kaki ilama hona himawai he board of honours within the school. But he held on to the word of God. Then aku kena buat follow follow. Then aku nak buat follow follow. Peri awa kaya nak buat kui. Biar hak orang nak tui, kau kalau fikir mai atau kau mam mai, kau mahu ia tui dalam hidup crazy. Kau jadi faham kalau orang tua kau boleh ambil aku lelai. Kau faham apa yang faham nak kau perahuan? Kau hingga kau bahu hingga kau faham. Let us acknowledge the sacrifices. As we connect the past and the present, there were sacrifices made. They were not made in front of the stage, but made behind closed doors. Fail alone and Ave Heli Lo. Kagwea, you have to look at what I have. But you don't need to go away. You will get one more. Let it be proved. Let it bring more fruit in the covenant that you guys are signing. You see, God always prepares. He never leaves us unprepared. And that's in his preparation for us to do this. 
But after the preparation, there is a commandment. In verse 12, it tells us. You see, unless you are prepared, he will not give you the commandment. And the commandment in verse 12, that you may love one another. Do you think this is the only woman in the world that your love will be given to? Grace? This is the only man in the world that your love will be given to. Love one another. But he gives her the standard. Please do not love the way the Hapai and the Mavalu. Mafana ya honey bumboko bong bongi tuki tuki ya tuki api ya But God said, love one another. As I have loved you. God is the standard. He is the source of love. Let me he become the center of this wedding and this marriage. Because people always run out. What do they run out of? When God is the center and the source, He is the vine that He speaks about. When things go tough, pick it here by you. Hold on to the vine. Jesus is the true vine. Hold on to it with all your life. Not with a doubt, not a 50% or 20%. Hold on to it. With all your heart, all your might, and all your strength. Because without love in marriage, marriage is no longer marriage. That is my encouragement. But then God says, You take my commandment, but if you love me, you must obey my commandment. <coughs> Obey the word of God. It is a treasure, it is a life that we often just receive and let it go out and someone else gets blessed and we get the emptiness. Don't be just a hero of the word, but be a doer of the word. The more you love the power of the now fear fear. They will be happy. Fear fear. Yeah. I forgot to lie here. See my family, my daughter, my mother. Yeah, I bet I want to talk to my kids. I'm going to do it for 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 my kids. Remain in the Lord. Remain. In Jesus. Amen. And the rest is history. Amen. Now let's just pray for doing praise. Eki, for the body of the Holy Spirit. Eki, Maula, by your two, Eki, your Tanaki. I delay a year. To get your Maula, your two. Nak kerja mau tu no apa yang tua, ia lalu tolol tengah ya aku. Kerja ngalor aku nak tolol mau tua dan aku hamba mai kalau fiamma, boleh follow. Kerja ngalor mau tua aku nak tolol nae, mohon nak mahal mai. Belum ia nak tui, kau ingat aku apa? Mau tua kau lelai tak apa ni mau tua ek ya kau fusi. Lelai tak hari mau tua teu teu fai lalu tofar aku mana? ตกลงกับตัวเองเหรอโอเคมาเวทีเหรอตกลงนี่ก็เห็นแล้วก็ฟังฟังบีดีฟอร์โอ้ก็เองเกี่ยวกับตัวเดียวล่ะยักษ์
Porque eu estou aí que lá o Maria fez a fofani para me fazer fiar no meu lotão lotão lá. Mas eu estou louco, mas eu estou louco. Fala eu estou aí que nega que me malava e arrumo. Da rua aí a fio. Nega que me malava eu estou aí que teu teu meu aí a palha de botar pe. Para o pau não veio cá o mais. Quando aí eu estou aí que mal fez fiar. Lota fala é cá o fuzi. Lota fala é arrumo na. Kai lo tu kau tahu aku hendi mahendi pamo kai na, aku ibe alelai pamo ingia. Fakfak kita fakat tahu lagi pe, aku wafa, aku faya mau faham mui, wafa atau si sukaisi. Amen. We are seeing grace. You have declared the love you have for each other and your hopes for the future. You have made promises to each other and have symbolized them by joining hands and giving of rings. You are now husband and wife. Do we? You may kiss your bride.